Holla peeps, it's your girl Cherie reporting live for Cherie TV. I know earlier I was like, I'm ready to go to the gym. I was ready to go to the gym. Baby even got up and everything. Made me pancakes and stuff. Guess what? That's right. I was like, babe, you want to go lay down? She was like, if that's what you want to do, I get so spoiled. I said, well, let's lay down. Y'all, I just woke up. What did you say? Holla. I feel like it's morning time. It's 4 20. It's like almost 4 20. Holla, 4 20. Ah, we said I woke up at the appropriate time. Wake and bake. Holla. Mm -hmm. What you say? Hit me up anyway. It's gonna be a beautiful day. It's just starting. Yeah. You know what I mean? Now I'm ready to go to the gym. You know what I mean? I feel so uh, excited and honored. You know, I'm going to be doing some stand-up tomorrow. Holla, I love it. It's great. I love doing stand-up. Love it, love it, love it. So if you have an event or a party or any kind of thing going on and you want to tap me for it, just hit me up. It's really easy. Holla. And I love doing causes. Okay. Any kind of cause or charity or if you are raising money for something or whatever like that. I love to do that. Baby, can you not like cough and hawk during Tree TV? Thank you. That's my baby. I love her so much. Baby, come be on Cherie TV. No. So I'm going to work out. I work out in my pajamas, okay? Because they are flannel. And you can wet sweat. Okay. What would I do without flannel pajamas? Well, number one, let's see, I die of pneumonia because baby keeps it so cold. Um, let's see, number two, I would be cold all the time. I'm very cold natured. Thank God for fleece pajamas. You know? What my love? You put it on high. I did. I put it on high. I did because of the computer. That's true, my love. I can't blame you right now. Nope. But actually, I'm not cold. Can't blame me. Nope. Can't blame the baby. Can't do it. Can't blame baby. Not this time. Cause I turned it on high. There's no greater joy, first, than love, but second, to making people laugh. I love to make people laugh. That's it, you know. You know how James, um, what's his name? The super freak? I'm the super fool. I like it. What's his name? Rick James. What was I, what was I calling him? James. James. Yeah, James is super freak. Rick James, holla. I really should open the door. It does wonders for the lighting. It's amazing. Honey, will you get up and open the door so that I don't have to leave the frame? She's laughing. Make sure this camera's not off. Isn't blurry. I 
I better do some knitting. I better do some knitting. Hello. Uh, what you say, your girl was she was thirsty too. Ooh, that was good. What you say, gotta go to the gym and get me a shot of wheat grass. Okay. Next year, the second one, you'd think they would set up cameras to monitor whether or not this is a pattern, because had they done so, they would have caught him abducting, say cops, the third woman in 2004. So, a lesson there. Now, I will tell you this, we've got a lot going on in the Jody Arias case. In the jail facility behind me, Jody Arias sits right now in the psych ward on Suicide Watch. Yes, you're on the psych That's ward in Suicide Watch. Jerry, Jody Arias, but she's in Arapaio's jail, y'all. You know the guy that had his own show? He liked the smell. Is that the guy that used to say, I love the smell of handcuffs in the morning? No. Oh, that was a different guy? Well, Arapaio's like the toughest warden in the country. Like, when you go to jail and you go to his jail, if you ever get out, you will not commit another crime because he is no fucking joke. That's where she is. Okay. Arapaio's prison is like no other. Not even Texas. Texas, they just put you to death. This this guy, he makes you do hard time. In tent, he got women in y'all, baby. Thank you, baby. He got women in tent cities. Okay, out in the heat, working on chain gangs. The guys have to wear pink, y'all, baby. Thank you, my love. Damn right, the guys have to wear pink. All pink everything, too. Totally emasculating. They should put her on death row there. Just show her on the chain gang and shit. Total humiliation. You know what I mean? Here Travis running around naked, slipping in his own blood. You know what I mean? Because of her ass. I was sitting in the sauna yesterday, and this woman started doing this. I don't know why she was doing that. And she left. I tried it. I was like, I was like, I don't know what she's getting out of that. So I'm gonna stop that crazy business. I don't know. Yeah. She was trying to produce a, I don't know, I don't know why she was doing it, but it looked neat, you know, the fuck, so today is my last chance workout, you know what I'm saying, gotta look good for the Bettys tomorrow, and all the peeps are gonna come to the Bettys Outrageous Adventures 12th year anniversary party, it is gonna be so fun, come to the jump off at Mango's Beach bar. It's going to be a lot of fun here in Las Vegas.
They were trying to say she on suicide watch. If she wanted to kill herself, she would have done it before. You know what I mean? She, she, bitch knows she don't want to die. Let her live for like, actually, death row on, um, in that state is 25 years, my love. 25 years. Let her sit there for 25 years, knowing her, da her date of doom. You know what I'm saying? Let her sit there with pains in her stomach. With headaches and everything. You know, she's a migraine person, so she would get migraines. You know? And all of us, we can just go on with our lives. I can't wait till tomorrow. With all this news and all this negative shit, we need some laughs around here. You know what I mean? Holla. We're almost approaching 12 minutes with this video, two peeps. Thank you for watching Sharit TV. Holla, Sheree TV. What you say? What you say? She says she want to rather die. Please. That bitch is too self-concerned to want to die. Okay? Talking about she would beg for the death penalty. Let's see her beg. Maybe she's begging. Maybe that's why no court till Wednesday. She, she's too busy begging. Throwing herself on the mercy of the court. Court, please. Help me, please. Don't kill me, please. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, I'm going to cut this off. You know that I love all of you guys. Thank you for watching Cherie TV. We'll have more for you very, very soon. Holla. Love you.